All right, so in this one, it's, it's a multiple choice question. I forgot to copy and paste the multiple choice, but we can work our way through it. The idea is to play around with what you're given using the laws of logarithms and to find equivalent ways of writing this expression. So how do we do that? Well, let's start by rewriting and playing around with the idea that 500 is 5 times 100. That seems promising to me. And also, the second one here, we can bring this exponent down in the front using the clog law, which is the law that says log of a to the c is equal to c times the log of a. And I just, I, you see that word right there? Clog. There it is. I called the clog law. And that would give us 5,000 where you bring that exponent in the front, just like we did right here, bring that c down in the front to get the clog. And that helps us rewrite and play around with the second term, which is the log base 5 of 5 now. Okay, now what? Well, this part right here can be split into the log base 5 of 5 plus the log base 5 of 100. And then we can subtract 5,000 because um, we have log base 5 of 5. That's just 1. What is the exponent of 5 that gives us 5? It's just 1. That's what it's telling us to do right there. And by the same reasoning, this is also a 1. So now we have this. We have something interesting. We have 1 plus the log base 5 of 100. Okay. And minus 5,000. Okay, we're getting somewhere here. And we can then rearrange that as the log base 5 of 100. And then minus 5,000 plus 1 is minus 4999. So there's one possibility, right, that we look at. And what's, a, what's another one that we could look at here? Well, if we rewrite, let's say, this first part right here, what could we do with that? We could write that as the log base 5 of 10 squared. That's 100. And, well, what else could we do? We could, again, use the clog law to bring that 2 down in the front, and we get this. Log twice the log base 5 of 10 minus 4999. All right, well, this allows us to construct, I believe, the other answer that's listed in the multiple choice, because if we think about what we did along the way here, Earlier on, what did we do? Earlier on, we had this minus 5,000 and this log base 5 of 5. So if we look at this and bring those terms back, those two things, what, they made this right here. So we can swap them back in to get twice the log base 5 of 10 and then plus log 5 of 5 minus 5,000, right? And that's another way of writing it. And there are other things we could do as well. I don't know if they were, I don't think they were listed necessarily in the problem, but like this over here, it's kind of an interesting one to play with because we could say the log base 5 of 100, well, 100 is just 25 times 4. And that means it also is the same thing as log base 5 of 25 plus the log base 5 of 4. And the log base 5 of 25 is 2, because 5 squared is 25, plus the log base 5 of 4. So this could have been broken down even another way. And I'm sure you can come up with other ways to rearrange the terms as well, especially since we have a subtraction sign here, and that gives you the potential for division, right? Let's just throw that out there. You could have made this the log base 5 of 500 over... 5 to the power of 5,000. Right, there's another way to rearrange it in this problem. So there's lots of things you can do uh, just by playing around with the laws of logarithms. All right, hope that helped.